Hello, this is Kush Sharma from smoothblogging.com. Welcome back to the Capturing Traffic on Your Blog video series. And in this video, we learn about a tool called Autoresponder, which helps you in capturing traffic that comes to your blog. Okay, so in the last video we saw, in order to capture traffic that comes to your blog, you can use opt-in forms like this one on the right hand side here, get email updates, join so and so subscribers. So you can see that this blog is using this opt-in form to capture email addresses. I showed you other kinds of opt-in forms like the one which pops over and you know, the one which makes the rest of the website dark and you can only see the opt-in form in the center, that's called a light box. So there are a lot of ways to collect email addresses. So this is one of the ways I showed you a squeeze page too in that video. So now what happens is this is just the first part that, okay, fine, you've got the email address now. So suppose I really like this blog and I read the articles and I really like them. What I can do is I can just subscribe to their email, uh, email updates by, you know, just writing my email ID here and clicking on join, okay? So what happens is when I do that, my email ID goes to the owner of this blog and he can use that email id to keep in touch with me but when your blog when your blog grows and you start to get tens of thousands of visitors to your blog then it's not easy to manually reply to everyone who subscribes to your blog okay it's almost impossible when that number starts to grow this is where an autoresponder comes into play what the autoresponder does is that when someone gives out their email id here and clicks on join that uh, the autoresponder sends them messages automatically and these messages are created by you so so basically it takes you out of the equation it automates the whole process even if you're sleeping and someone comes on your blog and just gives out their email id the autoresponder will start sending them mails that you've already written down in the autoresponder okay so it makes the whole process automatic and it's really a must because if you're really serious about your blog and you want it to be a professional blog, there's gonna be a lot of traffic on your blog and it's impossible to reply manually to each and every email. So you need an autoresponder. You need to grow your list, your email list by using an autoresponder. There are no two ways about it. And one of the most famous autoresponders out there is called A Weber. Some people pronounce this as Auber, but I think it's pronounced as A Weber because that's what most people pronounce it as. So this is one of the most famous and reliable autoresponders out there. So this would be my recommendation for you. And you can just, the link is given in the description of this video. You can check it out. And what, when you come here, you can just go down here, need an account and you can open an account with them. How you, how you open this account and how you set up Aweber on your blog is what the next videos are about and I'll guide you through that whole thing in a step by step manner. So this is a paid service, you'll be paying $19 a month, that's what the price is right now. They give you the first month free though and you only have to pay a dollar for the first month so you can see whether it's for you or not, whether you like this service or not. So what, so you know there are two ways of thinking about this, either you can wait for traffic to start coming on your blog a lot of traffic to start coming on your blog and then invest your money into something like this but some people also directly go in for this even if they're getting less amount of traffic and they uh, they have this on their website while they're building traffic so you can adopt either of those two ways okay and one other option with you is that you can go for a free autoresponder like listwire okay so this is same as aweber the only thing is it's free but if it's free there's it's, it's not surprising that the quality will not be as good as a Weber okay so you will have to compromise on the quality and uh, considering that email list is your biggest asset of your blog is the biggest money making object that you can have on your blog I would really suggest it that you go in for something paid because $19 a month is not much but if you want to try out you can go for list wire and you can uh, you just have to compromise on the quality a bit so there are a lot of other autoresponders free and paid so you can search on google if you want if you find a better one but these would be my recommendations and in case you do select aweber you can start watching the next videos and which will be about setting up aweber on your blog and explaining you the process of how you can capture the traffic that comes to your blog okay so i'll see you in the next video bye for now